everybody. It's Chopping It Up with Choppies. I always say Chopping It Up with who? Chopping It Up with you. Chopping It Up all with me. Chopping It Up on three, two, one. Hello, hello. We got amazing guests in here today. And they are out of, t- or they're from out of town. And only in here for a little bit. So even though we just had the holidays I figured I needed them in here ASAP. So that's why I'm a little rambled and scrambled and doing all of this because they also have to get back to their performance that they're doing today with 319's Finest. And like I said, I have to get them in here real quick, real soon. I'm just making sure I have you guys in my camera shots real quick. So this is August. What up? What up? <laughs> this is your camera right over oh, okay. here. <laughs> and... So tell us a little bit about who you are and what you're doing here and like where you're from and the drive and all that. Uh, my name's August Gonzalez. Um, I'm from Burlington, Iowa. I'm performing at 319's Finest uh, show tonight. Um, I kind of do a little bit of everything. I have like blended genre in my music. I do hip hop, uh, pop punk, um, a little R&B, pop, um, just a bunch of blended stuff like that. Um, and yeah. So, hey, that's it, yeah, so the sad. drive's about like an hour and a half, so not too bad. Uh, small little uh, river city on the Mississippi. So, are you excited to perform? I today? am, I'm pumped, I'm excited. Uh, it's my second time performing in Cedar Rapids, so just trying to network and make some connects up here. See, that's what I'm talking about. Before we switch it off to you, tell them how they find you. Uh, you can find me on Spotify, YouTube, um, whatever you use to stream music. I have a website, agusgonzalez.com. You can check that out and find out. All my stuff there. Um, so, yeah, that's where you can find my eee, stuff. Okay, okay. And the other guest we have today. Introduce oh, yourself. Oh, hi. <laughs> my ahead. name is VSA Chucky 333, and I come out, out straight out of Storm Lake, Iowa, little town. And hey. I'm here. So, how far, how far is the drive? It's like three hours. So, it's far, but we get into it. Hey, so do you be like pumping it up on the drive and like be practicing? Yeah, I'll be doing all kinds of stuff. I just be try to get myself ready and just get to it. Hey, so where can they find you? Uh, they can find me on all platforms at VSA Chucky 333. And I'm on YouTube, Spotify, Apple Music, all that. Hey, guys, and he got nominated, too. You can't forget that. You got nominated yeah. at the Iowa Music Awards. Mm-hmm. You want to talk a little bit about that? Uh, <clears throat> I got nom- nominated for uh, Best Latin Artist of the Year. Ooh. Uh, the crazy part... Is that I manifested it like at the beginning of the year. I told her I'm gonna be in the Iowa Music Awards, and sooner or later it happened. And I was excited. A lot of important people in that room felt badass. Man, that's so dope. Talk about manifestations. Talking about that, every time I listen to your music, August, Mm -hmm. I swear it's like spiritual to me, especially with Ali. Oh yeah. Well, I forgot. I forgot what song it was. See, I'm bad at knowing like (laughs) titles to anything. But like, I be listening. What, Hell yeah! What song is it? <laughs> I, th- I think you, I think you said magic. Yeah, but yeah. I just want mm-hmm. to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That one's that one's uh, that one's a vibe for sure. The whole EP is a vibe. Um, it's uh, it's called vibes. Yeah. So <laughs> the whole thing is a vibe better. for sure. Yeah. You have anything that uh, coming out anytime soon? Um, I have some stuff that I've been working on, and I plan on dropping my EP next year. And I'm working on that's kind of like a pop punk type of uh, album um, but with rap infused in it and then I have a rap album uh, EP that I'm working on right now so I plan on hopefully dropping that next year as well Ooh, I love that I remember the first time I seen you perform I thought it was lit like Hell I remember because yeah. it was like rap and then all of a sudden it was like punk and I was like hey this girl can get it okay yeah. okay so BSA what did you got coming up uh, I got some a couple of music videos Dumbo My Boy Shine, and then Woo-hoo. some from uh, Travy F- Fex. He's from uh, mm. Seattle Rapids. I tapped in. I came over here, and we made that. Hey. Yeah, but other than that, I'm trying to stay consistent with my singles. I got an EP, and maybe along the road, do something big. Hey, I love that. I love that. So when we were in the car on the way over here, I pretty much picked them up and I like kidnapped them, right? And my big old like, the, you know, my big old truck. And I was like, oh, you guys, you guys, you guys know how it is. I got a lot of kids. You know how those Mexicans are. And then 
I forgot that August is Mexican. Hell yeah, representing. I was like, because your last name is Gonzalez, right? Yep. yep. I was yeah. like, nah, this girl just can't be having no la- yeah. Mexican last name. And <laughs> Black skin in the building. Hey, I love that. I love that. And that's why I'm like, man, see, that's why I knew we clicked. There was something deeper, you know? <laughs> right. I love that. And so being especially a person of color, you know, in this industry and a woman, yeah. like how how is it like in a male dominated and just like how people view you and everything? Um, I feel like I don't know. I feel like ever since I've been young, uh, where I grew up, um, I was definitely the minority. So I feel like I always had to like prove myself that I was just as good as these white kids, just as smart as them and this and that. So I feel like I've kind of been doing that like my whole life, which is like everything, you know, I'm just trying to prove I'm just as good as these guys out here rapping. Like I can spit like them and all that. So, um, so yeah, it's just, I guess it's, it's just something I've been kind of dealing with my whole life. So for real, like being like, how do you say out of the ordinary, but making it your ordinary and be like, Hey, right. that's what's up. This is what it is. Yeah. And then I've I've heard your music too, VSA, and I'm just like hell yeah, he be spitting in Spanish too. Yeah, and hell I'm yeah. like bringing that Chicano rap back, like let's get it. Hell yeah, yeah hell yeah. Um, I could probably connect you with there's uh, I probably don't even remember their names. I'm not even gonna lie, but there's these guys that just came to the studio a few weeks ago, or for the IMAs, and they're from around that area like mm-hmm. on the like omaha side okay and they're chicanos too and they be they like i, I can see it mm-hmm. i can see it <laughs> i see it all so this was a real quick podcast i just wanted to introduce these guys to you guys uh because they we got we got to go back before they you know be running on the stage with you know for <laughs> their for their performance but definitely definitely have a full podcast scheduled in with vsa coming soon we'll keep that one on since this one was so short and then i gotta get you august Hell yeah. I'll be back. on the podcast yeah. so you guys stay tuned into that thank you very much for watching i'm chopping it up with choppies yeah. Ooh, yeah. let's go <laughs>